Senator from Florida, Mr. Rubio. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent that the reading be dispensed with. Without objection. I don't think I need to tell anybody here. Our work is at its best when it's focused on what people care about. Let me tell you what people care about. They don't, they don't care as much about buying solar panels and electric cars as they do not having to live in a community where violent crime is rampant and you've got some crazy prosecutor that refuses to put people in jail, that refuses to prosecute entire categories of crime. People are worried about that and rightfully so and it's happening. We have these beautiful cities that were once world-class cities that have become unlivable all over this country because we had these lunatic prosecutors that have decided they're not going to, entire categories of crime they will not prosecute. That's the kind of stuff we should be working on here tonight, all night long. You're going to spend all night working on something, work on that. Don't waste time on stuff that doesn't matter to real people working every single day who are not going to be driving an electric car next year or the year after that, but they might get mugged, but they might be a victim of a violent crime. And so what this does is it sends to the Judiciary Committee and asks them, in three days, come back with some ideas about how you can spend just a little bit of these billions of dollars that we're throwing away on this garbage, how we can spend a little bit of that money to put criminals in jail so Americans no longer have to live in fear in their communities. The Majority Whip. President, the senior senator from Florida says we should stop our efforts on reconciliation until we put money in law enforcement. So we check the record. When we put billions in local communities for law enforcement in the American Rescue Plan, the senior senator from Florida voted no. And when it came to the omnibus bill and burn grants and cops money that local organizations and law enforcement needed so they could be stronger and fight crime, 31 Republicans voted no, including the senior senator from Florida. So I would suggest we vote no on his amendment. Mr. President, I have time remaining. Senator's time's expired. All right. Now let's vote. Questions on the motion? Is there a sufficient second? There appears to be. The clerk will call the roll. Ms. Baldwin. The yeas are 50, the nays are 50, and the motion is not agreed to. Majority whip. Consent the following amendments be the next Republican amendments in order.